Hey guys, John Elder here with a very quick announcement that I think you're going to want to hear. I'm almost ready to publish my new Kinter book and I want to give all of you a free copy very, very soon. So this thing is almost out probably sometime next week. And like I said, I'll let you know how you can get a complete free copy, no strings attached, nothing to do, just free PDF copy and it should be cool. So what this thing is, is it's 150 pages and we're publishing it as a paperback. You can get it if you want on Amazon. But like I said, all you guys are going to be able to get a PDF version for free. And I'll tell you why the PDF version may be even better than the paperback version. So what this thing is, is the Kinter widget quick reference guide. And this is a horrible cover because no, no. So we're probably going to change the cover because I'm just not happy with this, but whatever the cover doesn't matter. In the meantime, like I said, this is 150 pages of Kinter widget attributes. So there are 37 Kinter widgets. There's like 19 regular widgets and then 18 TTK widgets. Every single one of them is in this book. And what this is, is just a list of their attributes. That's all there is. No fluff, no programming, no anything, just a list of their attributes. And why that's super important is when you're using a widget, you might want to use it in a certain way and you don't remember exactly how to do it. For instance, let's say you're using a text box. And when you highlight text in the text box, you know, it kind of changes color, kind of like up here. When I go like this, you see that it's blue here. Maybe you want that to be red in your text box. How do you do that? Well, I got to look it up. Well, that's where this book comes into play. Just flip over to the table of contexts, look down for text box. There it is. Text widget page 86, flip over to page 86. Boom. There's the text widget and it just lists all of the attributes. I don't know if you could see of the text widget, right? It's just alphabetically listing. So, you know, there's just for this one, I'm having trouble here. It's Friday. There's one, two, three and a half pages of attributes, right? So that's not a whole lot. You could just kind of skim through it. And I put a lot of white space in there so that it's easy to look through here and just kind of look through here. And you're like, wait, what is this? I want to highlight something. So I don't know. Let's look at highlight. Oh, highlight color. There it is. And it shows you, it describes what it is, tell you, tells you what to do. You slap that in there, change the color, boom, you're good to go. So I think this is going to be a very, very useful reference guide to have. And that's why it's going to be nice as a PDF. You could just open it up on your computer or whatever. The table of contents will be clickable. Click on the text widget table of context thing. It'll zap you right to that section. You look through it, you find the thing you want, you're good to go. And that's all this book is. So if you're using Kinter a lot, if you like using Kinter, you know, you have to look up something like that. The text thing online, it might take five, 10 minutes. Maybe you find it. Maybe you don't. The documentation isn't great all over the place. This has everything in one space, in one place, at your fingertips, and just really, really cool. So I think this is really useful. I will even probably use this myself because this 150 pages of attributes. Nobody memorizes all these things, right? So to have this at your fingers, you could just flip it open or with a PDF and you know click on the table of context or search it. Very, very useful. And this is not something I want to charge for. Like I said, we're going to be selling the paperback just because. So I, mostly just so I can go, hey, look at this. But all of you guys will be able to get the a free PDF version. I'll have, I'll throw up a website sometime next week. You can go enter your email address. It will pop it right to you. And that's it. Nothing to buy, nothing to sign up for, nothing to cancel later or anything like that. No credit cards whatsoever. Just absolutely free. My gift to all you guys for sticking with me and watching all these crazy Kinter videos I've been doing over the years. And I think it's going to be pretty useful for you guys. So this is a bit of a tease. Just wanted to let you know that this is coming. It is complete. It's finished. Uh, we're eventually probably going to change the cover because that's stupid. But for now, this is the cover. And <laughs> probably sometime middle to end of next week, I'll have the website up. We'll have it all set up where you can get this thing for free and it should be pretty cool. So just wanted to give you guys a quick update. I haven't been posting a whole lot of videos in the last week and a half, two weeks or so because I've been working on this and a couple other big projects. So hopefully next week we'll finish up a lot of those and get back to a more regular video posting schedule. Got a bunch of other cool things we're going to be introducing pretty soon on the channel, different programming languages and frameworks and things. Some of the things you guys have been asking for, some other things that I think are cool. Lately, we've just been doing NumPy. We'll probably finish that up and move on to the next thing. And that's what's sort of going on in the next week or two. So stay tuned. Get yourself a free copy of this. It's pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool. I think it's pretty useful. And like I said, there's just no fluff in here. There's no, there's like an introduction, but it's like a page and a half. Like, like literally this is the introduction. Two pages. That's it. Like the rest of it is just boom, right in with the widget information.
<laughs> so it should be cool and uh, keep an eye out for it. So that's all for this video. I'll see you guys next week with your free copy and uh, have a good weekend.